Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels. So if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Hi, how are you all doing? Um, the weather um, is um, has been it's sunny most of the day. Um, it was cloudy this morning um, with a bit of rain, but um, in the afternoon it's brightened up and it's lovely and sunny at night um, uh, which is absolutely fantastic um, today um, I'm going to be doing a top 10 best all-inclusive holiday to August 2023 part 2 and um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe and don't forget to click the notification bell so you never miss an upload and a big thumbs up and thank you for doing that I really um, appreciate it and um, the information that um, I'm getting on these um, top 10 um, hotel, uh, hotels and resorts um, etc is at uh, the times at dot co dot uk and um, so you can um go on to the times uh, website um and uh, you'll find uh, these there uh, there's also a link on there so um you can book any hot uh, these hotels or you could just google these hotels if uh, they take your fancy uh, accommodation and um, so kicking off uh, with number one rock at nevera grand hotel tenerife spain it's the best for convenience and um, it's on the south coast of Tenerife, a five-star hotel enjoying ocean views, an infinity pool, sunbed. Uh, you can also um, get a shuttle bus to the Sandy Blay a Player de Fandabee excuse my uh, my pronunciation beach and um, price for seven nights and um, from 1229 pounds um it's uh, the hotel has um got a spa pool three west uh, three restaurants to choose from um premium uh, drinks and um, included all premium all inclusive um so so your drinks are included in the price again i've been to tenerife myself and and i stayed in a four-star hotel um in playa das americas and it was absolutely fantastic really recommend it tenerife and um, it's just that lovely breeze uh, that you get um all year round um sometimes you do get a say a bit of wind but from my experience i've been there for seven nights um it was uh, just a lovely breeze and um number two um the voyage at bodrum turkey that's for adults at seven nights from 720 pounds including flights spa pool one restaurant and pre premium drinks are included again so again you can save money on your drinks and the premium as well and um i've been to bodrum turkey i stayed in gumbit uh, but i have been to bodrum and it's um, a wonderful resort with the ca uh, castle i have talked about this resort uh, before and it has a a large wonderful market and yes um it's a very nice place to visit and plus from Bo uh, God, bodrum you're not too far away from the resort in gumbit both gumbit and bodrum are lively resorts uh, so if you like um at bars wine bars at nightclubs um then again bodrum and gumbit um again are for you 
At uh, number three, Constance Morocco Fushy, Ara Dal Maldives, excuse my pronunciation, is best for luxury. If you're looking um, for a luxury holiday, seven nights from £3,393. And it has a spa pool, two restaurants, and premium drinks are extra. So that is not all inclusive. Or, well, or some of the drinks are included, but not the premium drinks. The premium drinks are extra. Number four, um, Occidental Sharara Grand Shahara United Arab Emirates is best for people that are looking for culture. Price seven nights um, is one thousand five hundred and thirty four pounds. It has a pool, two restaurants, and um, unfortunately, um, there's no alcohol served um, in the Sharaja Hotel excuse my pronunciation um unfortunately so again it's not for those um that are not that are looking that are looking for um a hotel that has alcohol because it's not served in the hotel at all um so you would, if you wanted to have al alcohol in the United Arab Emirates, you'd have to go out of the hotel complex. Number five, Casa di Campo Resort and Villas, La Ro uh, Roma, Dominican Republic, best for golf. So if you enjoy golf, then the Casa di Campo Resort and Villas, if you can afford it, in the Dominican Republic is recommended. Seven nights for £1,707, including flight, spa, and a pool, and eight restaurants. My goodness, I've not seen a hotel or resort that has eight restaurants. Um, premium drinks are extra. You probably get some drinks included but if you wanted to have premium drinks then you're going to have to pay extra number six um i hat at one sunny beach bulgaria best for budget breaks i've stayed in at sunny beach and i thoroughly recommend it and um, it has a lovely beach lots to, uh, lots to do um uh, like wine bars um, and uh, like pubs and clubs um, a really good nightlife um, and it has a lovely beach and um, it's also uh, ranked top uh, for value uh, best value for mo money in the post office 2022 it's a family holiday resort as well so you can take children children are welcome prices for seven nights uh, from 503 pounds that's including flights and transfers there's a spa pool and restaurants and um, if you did want premium drinks then you would have to pay extra you probably will have some drinks included in the price but again premium drinks um exp expensive drinks are extra uh, moving on to number seven um olympic lagoon resort papas cyprus uh, seven nights uh, from uh, £739, pounds, including flights and transfers, best for short um, haul sun. So if you're not looking to um, tra uh, travel very far on an aeroplane or maybe it's, say, your first time flying, then again it's um again a, a good place to travel to um because again it's less than five hours to get when i went to cyprus and um, it was about four hours and 20 minutes um 
I did go to Larnaca Airport though and not Paphos but again um, this resort Paphos uh, Cyprus does look a very uh, nice and interesting resort it's um, again a lot quieter than the resort that I went to Eve Salaraki um, or at least supposed to be um, number eight uh, Margaritaville Island Reserve Riviera can Jun, Mexico, excuse my pronunciation, uh, best for millenniums at uh, seven nights from 1589. It has a spa, pool, and uh, two restaurants. Uh, premium drinks are extra though. And moving on uh, to number nine, Potter's Resort, Hopton on Sea, Norfolk, UK. I've been to Hopton on Sea. I've not stayed in Potter's Resort, but I uh, did stay in Haven Holiday Camp, um, camp there, and it has, um, from what I can remember, a beautiful uh, beach. Um, again, it's best for if you're wanting a staycation. Uh, price uh, for four nights uh, from £549 pounds. Um, it has a spa in it, it also has, also has a pool, restaurant, premium drinks are extra. And uh, number 10, last but not least, um, is Lux Grand Goodbye Mauritius, or Goodbye Mauritius, best for design. So if you are looking for a hotel or resort that has the best uh, design and uh, then uh, this according to the times is uh, the very best one it has spa a pool and a uh, price for seven nights is from 1171 pounds that's including your flights four restaurants uh, premium drinks mostly included um but again some drinks may not be included so um again you'd have to check with the hotel um if premium or any hotel that you go and visit um for premium drinks uh, whether they're included or not or drinks if you're if you're if you're staying mainly in a all-inclusive then some drinks at least would be included um but again not for say for premium drinks so i would like to sa say uh, thank you for watching um and um, i'll see you tomorrow for um my travel and my lifestyle improvements updates and more um i hope you have um, a wonderful weekend all of you and um, I hope everybody is uh, w as well as possible. But um, again, um, you can, with all inclusive um, hotels and resorts, um, read what's included. And again, um, check if you need to pay extra for premium drinks. So thank you for watching and have a, a good day or night wherever you are in the world and bye for now. Thank you. Bye.